people. Welcome back to Fox 17 Morning Mix. Here from the Humane Society of West Michigan, we have Megan with the ever so beautiful Izzy. Izzy's here. Izzy. Hey, hey, such good a morning. good girl. Izzy is a puppy. Megan, tell us her story. Yeah, so Izzy is 10 months old. <laughs> um, so yeah, still a puppy, still has that puppy energy, but um, she is very, very smart as we were playing with her earlier, we found she knows sit, shake, down. Yeah. Um, just a really, really sweet girl and uh, got a little bit of growing to do. <laughs> Izzy, Izzy, Izzy. He's watching everybody behind Izzy's the scenes. Loving Bailey right now, just follow, tracking him across the studio. <laughs> Love it. Hey. She can definitely see his shepherd markings and all that. Oh, yeah, that. she's a shepherd lab mix. Yeah. I don't know if I mentioned yeah. that, yeah. And really, really um, smart and sweet. And I don't want to shift gears too quickly, but mm -hmm. Catter Days are back and that's a big deal. Yeah, they are, that's right. So um, going forward through 20 2020, we are kicking off Catter Days again, <laughs> meaning that on Saturdays, all of our adult cats are going to be fee waived, um, which is a huge deal. Um, and if people are interested in adopting a cat, it is only at our facility um, on Wilson. Mm -hmm. And um, people can come in, meet a cat, and be able to take them home uh, free. Aww. And also one thing, speaking of cats, mm -hmm. um, we have two cats in our household. We've talked about them often here. But when it came to bringing Bronson home, mm -hmm. the two cats there, that was kind of an interesting thing that I think people scared me more than what it actually turned out to be because I loved him. Yeah. But <laughs> you guys have something where you guys can do the introduction type thing? Yeah. So people? we uh, offer a Baby Ready Pets seminar yeah. um, where people have the opportunity to come um, and learn kind of what it means to um, bring a baby into the home when you have pets or vice versa. If you have a baby at home bringing home um, a, a new pet it, it, in a lot of circumstances it can be a difficult transition yeah. and a lot of times it's one of the top reasons that people return a pet unfortunately right. um, so we want to help people kind of uh, to make that a little bit easier for them so January 25th we're having a seminar 10 a.m. and it is a suggested donation of ten dollars but we really just well want to help it. people yeah definitely well worth yeah. it yeah and it may not seem like it but it is gonna happen we're, we're gonna get sleep we're gonna get snow yes. we're gonna get that cold weather Mm -hmm. And cold weather is a whole different ball game when it comes to your pets and yeah. taking care of them. Right? It is. So we try to encourage people to think about it just like you would yourself. If it's too cold for you to go outside, it's too cold for your pet to go outside. Um, and if you have pets that are typically outdoor pets, consider bringing them inside, especially when it gets down to those really low temperatures. Mm -hmm. It can be really dangerous for pets, just as it would for a human to be out there like that. Let's make sure that we're treating them well and uh, finding them homes. You want to show everyone again the, the tricks that you just... Yeah. <laughs> is he found us, uh, is found he us I mean, snip. Is he sick? No, oh, come, here. She, well, come here, look at this. She did some good sit. for you, though. Come here, I know she was doing really sit. good. Oh, here, sit, oh, shake, good girl. You're such a good girl. You want to treat so bad, don't you? I don't she have any. So bad, don't she has you? eyebrows, don't you? You're a good girl. Is, is such a cute, adorable, and sweet, and wouldn't jump on the couch. Yeah, we tried to get her here. to come up here on the couch, and she wouldn't come up. She so was, if you're not a, a like, you would love it when the animals stay off the furniture. She's is well it trained. might be for you because she <laughs> would not come up here no matter what we did to get her up here. She was like, nope, I'm good. I'm good down here. Right so ten months old. That's a great. That's a great age, still. Yeah, you yeah. Know, she's still great. got she's a little bit of puppy little, fun, but yeah. not the crazy baby puppy yes. training. And pretty yes. much done growing. This yeah. is her, this is her size. She'll fill in a little bit, probably. Yeah. But she's, she's yeah. And look at this face. I mean, come <laughs> on. Right? You adopt me. She's very gentle. So respectful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's very respectful. Mm -hmm. All right. So Izzy, all the other. Beautiful critters at the side of West Michigan, 3077 Wilson Drive, Northwest, Grand Rapids, 616-453-8900. They're great on Instagram, they're great mm -hmm. on Facebook, and they're really good about posting the animals as they come in. Window shopping. Oh, have to say, oh you'll like that moving <laughs> camera. <laughs> the camera starts moving. Right, look at she's oh, hiding. Like, wait a second, oh, the camera's so moving. Right, baby. The camera. <laughs> oh, so anyway, if you're looking for a, if you're looking for a pet to start 2020. Oh, Izzy here might be the, the best option for mm -hmm, you. Look, definitely. She's, she's not, yeah, not aggressive at all. She didn't like little, the little camera timid, actually. was moving, it scared the her. Moved, and she was like, that scares me. Why is it moving? <laughs> it's, okay. it's okay. It's okay. Good girl. Hey, thanks so much for watching Fox 17 Morning Mix. Make sure you reach out to Main Society to give Izzy it's and all okay, the girl. other animals a wonderful it's home. Okay. Mel Robbins is up next. Midday's at 11. Have a great weekend. Be safe out there.